With Stebbings Car Superstore, we're sure you'll find your next car. From the Kings Lynn News Centre, I'm Tristan Hunkin. The number of firearms officers in Norfolk has fallen by more than a quarter over the last year, despite heightened concerns about a terror attack. Twelve months ago, the county had 175 armed officers. That's dropped by 48 in the last year, down to just 127. Officers are warning, given the changing terror threat, more officers need to be trained in firearms. Despite contacting Norfolk Police last week, they've yet to comment on the figures. Norfolk has the second highest rates of drowning in the United Kingdom, with 13 deaths in the last year in Norfolk alone and 321 fatalities across the nation. Adrian Lowell is a water safety expert from the Royal Life Saving Society. Take the time to, to look and learn before diving in. Uh, taking that bit extra bit of time uh, could potentially save a life. To find out more tips for staying safe, you can check out our Safer Summer Guide at klfm967.co.uk. A rider and their horse are rescued after getting cut off by the tide off the West Norfolk coast. Coast guards were scrambled at around four o'clock on Friday afternoon when the pair made their way to Skolts Head Island near Burnham Overy Stave. It was decided to wait with them until the water had gone down and walk them back across the channel. With your news first, this is KLF. With Stebbings Car Superstore, we're sure you'll find your next car.